What's going on guys and welcome to the video. In this video I'm going to talk to someone about how they feel about coronavirus. So let's begin. So, what's your opinion? What's your opinion on coronavirus? How has it affected you? Look at the screen. No. Guys, what's going on and welcome to the video. Now, in this video, I'm going to talk to you about what I think, personally, is the worst thing about Corona. Co nah. I'm not going to call it Corona or COVID in this video. I'm going to call it the C-Virus. That's right, guys. I'm going to explain my thoughts on the C-Virus. We're starting right now. Guys, I know, this is a weird, oh, different camera angle than what's normal, but I'm going to roll with it. Anyhow, for me, honest opinion is all the stress, all the panic, all the negativity and anxiety that this sea virus is causing us. Now, obviously... I have some tips to help you. So here's my first tip. No dirty jokes guys. Come on. It's YouTube. Think of the kids. And don't think of the kids. <laughs> oh god, let's just continue the video. <laughs> um right, tip number one. It's let's see, fear, panic, stress. It's uh it's what you feed your mind. What you feed your mind is what you think about in your subconscious. So basically, if you're watching the news all day, all through the day, you're going to be stressed. You're going to be feared. You're going to be fearful. You're going to be anxious. You're going to be panicky. You're going to have a lot of uncertainty. But here's what I do. I used to wake up in the morning, watch the news, all through the day, watch the news, before going to bed, watch the news, and it was destroying me, like, with, like, the anxiety and the stress and the nerves and uncertainty. So here's what I do. I limit it. I limit my news consumption to once a day. So, for example, I'd watch the six cup news, get all the details, and then, all right, see if there's anything good, see if there's any progress, see if there's anything positive. Arms get sore. <laughs> see if there's anything positive. Then I knock it off. Also, I've been following the journal. They give you the news as well, but they break it down into segments and they give positives too, as in how many people are healed, uh, information on a vaccine or a cure. Anyhow, that's the first tip, guys. I have to get some shopping, but after that, I'll give you the next tip. Right, time to get me shop, and I'll talk to you in the next tip. Guys. Tip number two, wear the gloves, wear the gloves, going out, come back, wash your hands, 20 seconds with soap, keep replacing your gloves, stay safe guys. Right, next to tip three. Tip three, that, that, that was way too sexual. Tip three is do your shopping. Get yourself wipes. Get yourself a spray and wipe down all the stuff you got. And when you're done, throw out the bag. You know, you, you don't know what's on the bag and stuff. So let's get wiping.
cannot reuse the wood. Keep going, guys. Keep going. Keep using different wood. Make sure it's safe. Make sure we're away from everything. And is this still recording? Yes, it is. Good stuff. Change the wood. Keep going. I should tell you what I'm buying. I got some uh, croissants there. And got some orange oil now. But it's quick, it's probably as fine as to be healthy, guys. But you keep eating unhealthy. Well, by the end of it all, you'll just be fat. And you know what? No one wants that. Hey, that rhymes. Wipe. Keep spraying the stuff. Wipe. Usually a table will be more sufficient, but I have company out there, so <laughs> they don't. You know, this is a solo thing. The vlogging is a solo thing for me. I'm okay being on camera. I'm not camera shy. I'm pretty sure you're all aware of that. Right now. Alright, 16 subscribers. Got some initials. Yeah, first of the city, two initials. Thanks for all. Ah, cook first. Uh, breakfast. No, it's not really a proper breakfast, to be honest. Like I have a porridge or egg. You know, back up stuff, chicken for chicken for like a lunch. I had a turkey and what I had? I had a turkey and egg mayonnaise. Bro. Not me walk down back here. And it was lovely. Usually I don't eat turkey until Christmas. But it was gorgeous. Just a few more bits to go. It's good. Otherwise it's good to get out of the house. Do a shop. Once you're safe. Once you do stuff like this. You're doing good. Give it a good wipe. I got popcorn there and I've got two liter of milk and I got a one liter of milk. So I'll have loads of milk and spare milk. Right way to go guys. Yeah, I'm just saying with bag. Get rid of it. So, uh, yeah. That's everything's clean. Be moist will clean the gloves. Get the clean. Get the gloves, a bit of a spray there. And then wipe around, get rid of the any germs. Right there. Right. Put down the bag. And get our wipes. Spread wipes. So we have anti back stuff on them. Clean your hands. And guys, that is tip number three. Tip number three to help you deal with this coronavirus. Or should I say, the C virus. And uh, stuff you brought back into your house. Now, Excess moisture on your hands. Uh, 
can't eat back your hands. Kill any germs. I think I'll wonder. No. My arse is wet now. But it's worth We will get through this, guys. That is three tips for you now. Um, before this video ends, I'll give you a few more tips, written exercises, that will help you get through this pandemic. To help you get through this coronavirus thing. So, I'm going to put my shop now. Then, I'm going to give you these exercises that will help you calm your mind and keep yourself focused and centered. Right, guys? Boom! Guys, get yourself a calendar, write out your plan for 24 hours, write out what you're grateful for. Also, write out the negatives of the day, and write out the positives of the day, and compare them, and see which one you want to live your life according to. Thank you. Guys, I will discuss those ideas in another video. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe. Always be kind, be human, and I'll talk to you on the next video. Talk to you later. Be human.